Squirrel-tastic coming at ya. Here we go. We're gonna finish this level up. Three more stars. You know what this level needs? What? More sand. Really? It's not, not like that much. Just like two cubic tons. Okay. Just like two cubic tons of sand over there. A little pile. Alright. Two cubic tons. You got it. Nice. Next time you load up this level, there will be two cubic tons of sand. <laughs> two cubic tons? Tons. Oh, man. I just misspoke. You never misspeak? I'm, I'm a little bit drunk. Yeah, you've been drinking. Um, lots of... Uh, what is it? <sighs> what is it? It's pink stuff. Pink stuff. Cotton candy flavored brandy. That's okay. <laughs> Thank you, uh, Ditto, for reminding me. <laughs> that's that's my drink of choice, friends. Uh, you oh, why did I take the shell? I didn't need the shell. Oh no, man. Mm -hmm. Took the shell. For fun. I need something to crash into. Just, just, just. You. I'm gonna die. Am I? I don't know. I'm afraid for you. I'm afraid for, um... Rob Brody? Uh, yeah, him. And... Pretty much... Most of America. Oh, I'm... Yeah. Yeah. I worry for them. Yeah. Uh, People are gonna be like, oh, you guys aren't American? Uh, nah. No. <laughs> As we've mentioned multiple times now in our videos, we don't live in America. <laughs> Yeah, but we could. We could. I mean, we it probably could. wouldn't be very hard. You know, most of the people on the internet apparently live in America, but no, not us. And I don't know if it just but, feels that way, like... The Americans just kind of conquer the internet? It um, certainly feels or that way, I just yeah. feel like, in general, media, like, if you're oh, watching media, YouTube, yeah, yeah. it often feels like everyone's American. Although I do see people with accents, so I can kind of assume that maybe not in America. Yeah, there's quite a few people in the UK that uh, I follow personally. Yeah, same. Um, but, like, movies and stuff. Oh, yeah. Everything happens in New York. Yeah. Well, it's annoying, too, because, like, we live in BC and so much stuff gets filmed here. And then it's, like, not set in Canada, even. And they're like, yeah, okay, cool for the film industry that it's cheap to film here. But, like, how many times am I going to see landmarks that I recognize and they're claiming to be in other cities? Like, <laughs> I'm worried about my wing cap not holding out. Mm -hmm. Oh, good bridge. Time to land. Yeah, definitely. Okay, we're okay. You did it. You're fine. Like, um, a good example is, like, although this is not supposed to be in America, but a good example of something recognizable being in media from here is, like, um, there's this school in Burby called Simon Fraser University, and oh, it, sh yeah. it shows up in Stargate SG-1 so many times as, like, alien planets, and I'm like, how many times are you going to use this same campus? Like As many times as they can. <laughs> yeah, clearly, they did. <laughs> I remember going there one time and being like, oh, I recognize these buildings as, like, an alien world. <laughs> not not as the buildings that they are, but I actually remembered the, the planet. That yeah, my, so my old friend uh, Brandy, she was going on about how she visited the sets of Stargate often. Oh, yeah? yeah. I believe it. Yeah, I, I think I was a little late to the Stargate fandom because I didn't, like go to any conventions for it or, you know, whatever, do any of that kind of stuff. Uh, which is too bad, because I probably could have, yeah. you know, explored stuff back when it was a thing, because it was local, but whatever. Whatevs, man. Yeah, whatevs, man. That's a, that's a show that I still haven't finished. Um, is it on Netflix? <laughs> um, I don't know. I think it was. I have the first bunch of seasons on DVD, I think the first six or seven. Yeah, something like that. And then I just wasn't able to find them anymore. There is a box set that's pretty cool looking, but I'm not sure if I feel like it's worth the investment because... 
I have so much of it already on DVD. Yeah. I, I mean, every time I think about getting rid of the DVDs, it makes me want to watch it again. So I feel like... So you're attached to them, clearly. Yeah, so, like, so maybe it is worth the investment eventually. I'm not sure. But I never quite finished the series. Um, I'm either in season 9 or 10. I can't remember. I think there's 10 seasons. And uh, I got to, like, the Ori plot. Like, hollowed are the Ori or whatever. And it just kind of, like, stressed me out a lot. Because uh, it's all about, like, these gods, basically, on another plane of existence. Messing with the, the Stargate peeps. <laughs> and causing them problems. And, uh, and basically, like, you either have to agree to worship them, or they'll kill you and your whole planet. The whole planet? Basically. And so it just really stressed me out as an atheist. Um, so, and I, like, I just kind of stopped watching it. <laughs> right, I'm just gonna shuffle on over here. You moved my phone. Here's your phone. Thank you. It is no longer moved. It... I just think that it's rude to take my phone where it's within my reach and put it on the other end of the room. Puts on the armrest of the chair. Mm-hmm. It's not a great place to have it's it. It's the best place to put it. Where's Mips? I don't know. Mips, come, come There here. he is. I was thinking about him earlier, actually. Come here, you little how you're gonna weasel. Have to catch him. Oh, that was really good. Thank you. He cannot be late for tea. Okay. Thank you for the star, Mips. Dumb it. He shall be remembered as a hero. And a scholar. And a gentleman. I assume Mips is male. I don't know. Mips is dead now. Well, he's not dead. He just picked him up and like, he's just like, oh, I give up on life. See, he's fine. Oh, okay. He's going to the fire world with me. Mm. That looks really fun. Boil the big bully. Is that shape that was in the painting supposed to be Bowser's face? No, it was um, just... They're not, like, in this game, but there is an enemy that jumps up from fire and it has a face and it just kind of bounces up and bounces right back down. Oh, like on the Super Nintendo? Yeah, sometimes they have faces. Usually they do not. But I'm pretty sure that's what we were looking at. Okay. They're pretty cute on the SNES. In Super Mario World? If I'm thinking of them right. I don't think they have a face on Super Mario World. Do they not? But you have might a be face? thinking of Hotheads. Maybe. Because Hotheads are kind of a cute, like, fiery, electric, debatable enemy. <laughs> I don't really mind this level. I know this is a lot of people's like, oh man, this level's the worst. Oh yeah. I think that lava levels just stress people out because everything's red. Oh, it's, maybe. It, like, makes it really... It's like you can't touch the ground. And... Yeah. Oh yeah. Okay, here we go. So we are 47 stars in, holy moly. Yeah. Rad. Dickles. Rad Dickles. Are you enjoying uh, mm -hmm. OK KO? Uh, I feel like I haven't watched enough of the show to form like a real opinion on it, but I'm not against it. Yeah, it's, you know, it's all right. <laughs> yeah. It's like, fine by me. It's kind of like rad retro, which in general I'm not like, oh yes, let's have all media be like retro just for the sake of it. Yeah. Um, but I, I don't mind the way that they did it on OKKO. OK it's kind of like, yeah, a little bit retro-y feeling, but it's not like, oh, this is set in the 80s and everything is just what was available then, you know? Yeah. It's more just like an aesthetic choice. So so I can get behind it. And I, I feel like it's cute. I just don't feel like I get all of it. <laughs> <laughs> You're probably not supposed to. Maybe not. I just I think I just haven't watched enough of it. It takes me a few episodes to kinda get a feel for a show and like make sense of their humor and stuff sometimes. Yeah, that's fair. Um 
Yeah, like that one episode we saw and the boss was just hanging out in the clouds. And then he, uh, dove in elbow first and landed on a bad guy. Yeah. He's like really OP, the boss. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I liked Radicles getting famous for the dumb thing that he didn't want to get famous for when he was trying to get famous for something else. <laughs> Hashtag relatable. Yeah, he was like, oh, wasn't that a great video? And everyone just liked the weird word that he used, but he's like, I'm an alien. Yeah. It has meaning in my language or something. You guys are using it out of context. Yeah, you're using it wrong. And he started getting mad because everyone wanted him to say that word all the time. And nothing else. And they didn't care about his comedy. Well, that was fast. Yeah. 49 stars. Excellent, excellent. Let's follow it up. Get number 50. Dude. 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 Okay. It. Blind jump. It's In not blind jump. World. I know. What, no, I know. I know it's there. I know you know what's there, but from my perspective, you just turned around and jumped into the lava. It's like the fifth time I've done I it. I know, but it just. I'm tired. Tired of what? So it surprised <laughs> me this time. <laughs> wow. Here we go! If they all took that long, you'd be done by now. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> well, no, it's just the Sandland really slowed me down, because I don't really like it, and I'm not that good at it. Uh, and... So what you need to do is spend several hours just doing that course over and over again, <laughs> so you're really fast. Oh, then I'll hate this yeah. game. Because that's worth it. I like this game a lot, you know. I do know. All right, let's do some shredding. Shredding. So I'm going for a hundred coins, baby. Okay, let's do it. Yeah. Then I'm gonna go ass first into a pile of lava. Okay. Get your ass will preach. That's okay. Oh shit. Shoot, I oh. couldn't figure out where the ground was in relation to me. That happened. <sighs> I'm the worst. You didn't have like 98 coins or something. I got 98 coins and Mario ain't one. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, Mario is not a coin. He should be. Fun fact. I'd love a Mario coin. <laughs> okay. Like, comment, subscribe, and uh, tell Find your... us on Facebook and tell us what you'd do with a Mario coin. Tell your mom about us. Yeah, your mom will definitely care and understand. Always. Every mom. For horse monkey. <laughs> Still doable. It's just much harder. I swear yeah. I landed on it there. Yeah, I think so, but... Okay, I'm gonna be a little more careful this time around. Okay. So yeah, I, don't wanna, I don't wanna spend, like, a whole episode of me, like, dying doing the same mistake. Yeah. Sober up, Neil. <laughs> I can't. Okay. Then I can't I has... Excuse me. No excuses. I don't mean to yawn quite so much. Really, why? I'm not sure. <laughs> is, is it time to call it? It might be. I'm too tired. <laughs> Maybe I'll finish this world and then, yeah, we'll, we'll continue this another time. Alright. Sounds good. That seems fair. I'm sure the viewers at home won't be sad and leave oh, us they're gonna be comments. so. Oh, they will, though. Oh, they're just gonna be like, oh, you pussy. Like, you know what. How dare you? You know what internet people are I like. I do. They're gonna be like, lol, <sighs> you're not a squirrel. Hater's gonna say it's fake. Faker's gonna say it's hate. It's true. <laughs> yeah, you're hired as like a enemy <laughs> voice actor. <laughs> Just walk the line. <laughs> don't care. Whatever. Beach hair, don't care. Underwear. Underwear. Say a prayer. It's not fair. The camera is way too close. Yes, it is. I just wanted it to be behind Mario for that. <laughs> Okay, this is what I'm looking for. This um, lava is making me think of um, tomato 
sauce that we had recently <laughs> on rice. <laughs> oh, that? Yeah. We, ha we ordered Chinese food. Kind of gives you that, that tongue feel. Yeah. We ordered this Chinese food and we tried tomato fried rice. And it was just normal fried rice with a layer of tomato sauce on top. <laughs> that's weird. Thanks. I don't know if that's like a thing, but I've never ordered it before. Um, and the place we were from had it, so... I don't know, we're trying to do some vegan alternatives. Yeah, man. Vegan. Not to be confused with Keegan. Keegan is no vegan. No. No, it's a lonely vegan existence. Why are you vegan with you pretty often? Yeah, I'm not totally vegan also. I don't want to misrepresent myself. <laughs> I just try to eat vegan when I can. And if I can't, it's, yeah, I'm not gonna die. And if you can, if you don't, if you will, if you do, because you won't, if oh, you- Oh, you already got that one. Yeah. You're just doing it for the cold ones. Bro. Bro. Do you forget? Bro, yeah, I'm a little bit too tired to fully remember everything that's happening. Nice. Yes. So next time I'll forget what we did, and then you can tell me again. Ah, uh, that coin is lost. Yeah, it, it, it's gone. Can you still do it? Nope, that was it. No, that was it. You have to get every freaking coin in the whole level. Is there levels like that? Um... I don't think so. I think every level has like well over 140. Oh, okay. But none I've seen like get 150. I don't know, I don't want people to, like, be, Oh, you dumbass, this, this level has level precisely 161! Just, just based on your experience, I was wondering if there was one where you have to be, like, really careful, like, oh, better... There's some area, like, this one in the Shifting Sandland, you kind of have to try to get as many coins as you can before you enter a second part of the level. Oh, okay. Yeah. Interesting. We're at 86. Which I think I might have done at this point. No! Oh my god. I'm gonna be okay. Holy shit. You cannot get hurt again. Okay. This is for all of the marbles. Come on, notice me, senpai. You're running too fast. You know, but if I sit still, he'll shoot at me. Okay. Okay, there we go. Thank God. <laughs> Thank Madoka. Alright, I am nine coins away from my goal. One. <laughs> One. So you're gonna say something? I was just laughing. <laughs> Ninety-nine! You can do it! Find a good one. I don't know, man. Is there a coin somewhere? It's too much pressure. Honestly, this kind of stuff would stress me the fuck out. Really? Yeah, I don't- oh, oh, I don't like pressure in video games. That's why I like to play puzzle games and- Well, puzzle games have their own kind like of stress. Animal Crossing. <laughs> play games. To relax and have fun. No. Not to have freaking heart attacks. MLG Doritos. This uh, this p ground is made of Reese's Pieces. Uh, I think that's a regional candy. You might have to explain that. Um, they kind of look like M and M's, but they're peanut butter inside. <laughs> I mean, they're peanut butter candy inside, and um, they're the same colors as this floor, but they're just like little flat disc things. Yeah. I was gonna say, I like Smarties, but Smarties are regional too. Yeah, in some place. Actually, I think in America, Smarties are like what rockets are. Here. Yeah. So there's, um. Yeah, here, Smarties are like M&M's, but they're a different brand. And in other places, there's these powdery sugar, like weird discs that are kind of like the buttons on a SNES controller. <laughs> and you put them in their, your mouth and they either dissolve or you can kind of like cr 
crush them into a powder very softly. And they're very weird. Um, and here those candies are called rockets. Because I guess we already had a candy called Smarties, so... Smarties is a confusing term. Internationally, anyway. Yeah, internationally. Which the internet is. It's international. It sure is. Alright, final star of the level. Oh, thank Madoka. Yeah. Let's do it. Alright, Madoka, let's go. Thanks, Madoka. Madoka's my best friend. I thought I was your best friend. I'm pretty offended right now. Um, you know, like, how you're also my best friend. Okay. I do know that now, because you just said so. Okay, great. Okay. Well, I'm glad we, we had this talk. Glad we cleared that up. Yeah. Well, let's never speak of this again. Okay. All right, here we go. On the boat, I guess. On the boat again. Platform. This nicely painted platform. Oh, yeah, it's beautiful. Oh, yeah, absolutely. You know, they... Bowser put this together for you. For me. In, like, a week. That wall clipping isn't very good there. Don't don't knock him. Okay. He, he Whoa, jeez. work into it. I was admiring the background and... And then you, f you fell. ...into almost lava. Well, you, you saved yourself. Is that thing back? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Bowser thought ahead. Sure did. He was like, what if Mario falls off? Gotta make it What if he admires the background too much? Yeah. I did make the inside of this volcano really beautiful for him. Yeah. <laughs> Or do you think that, like, Mario runs through the same areas, like, every time that him and Bowser do this? Bowser just switches it up a little bit. That would explain the whole, like, uh, every world two is a sand land. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I just gotta wait for this fire to pass. Position Mario. Leap. Leap. Oh. Oh. oh! I see where you're going. Oh, Do you? Right. No. Okay. Where are you going? So this is like not nearly as lined up as well as you'd think. Yeah. One little false step and you fall. Well that's annoying. Yeah, so you gotta be particularly careful. Even though the star looks like it's right there. Yeah. Okay. Uh, next did. time on Squirreltastic. Good job. Thank you very much. <laughs> All right. Good night, everybody. Bye.